What's going on everyone? In this video I'm going to show you how to utilize Google badges to boost your map rankings. So the first thing you want to do is log into your Google account or wherever you're managing your Google My Business listings and type in Google badge into search. And then you're going to go over to this developers page Then you want to select the um, the Google Plus page that you want to boost up. So we'll just do uh, Dent Repair Doctor. So you can see here that Google gives you a badge, which is pretty much an embed code of your Google Plus listing. You know, the best thing to do with this is you want to embed this on other properties, you know, just to give your listing a boost. So we're going to take this code right here and throw it into a notepad. Then the next step you want to do is uh, take this URL right here because we're also going to use it for link building and save that into the notepad as well. Okay. The next thing you want to do is go over to FCS Networker or if you use Money Robot or any type of automation uh, software to uh, further embed your properties. You know, I like to use this. This is my personal favorite. So I'm going to create a quick account and I'm going to do this fast so you guys can uh, just get an idea of how this works. So I'm going to create a, project, a blog project and we'll call this Google Badge Embed Dent Repair. Okay, next we're going to go over to linking and we're going to choose a link set and this is where we're going to create a brand new link set and we're going to call this uh, Google Local 301. And the reason I'm calling it Google Local 301 is because this URL that Google provides that links over to your map listing URL is actually a 301 redirect. You know, so instead of building links directly to the Google My Business URL, we're building it to this 301, you know, just to give it a, a safe buffer. And just to confirm that it's a 301, you can go over to testuri.org forward slash sniffer. And you can see I inputted the URL. And it re uh, returns as a 301 status right here, which points over to the map listing URL. So again, I'm going to, you know, use this to build links to. And for main anchors, I'm going to use Google Plus, Google Local Page, and then some broad terms like Dent Repair, some uh, branded terms, Dent Repair Doctor. mobile dent repair and then I'll do some geographic modifiers without the keyword so Oklahoma City and OKC all right so that's it for our links we're gonna select that so you can see the new link is selected and the next thing you want to do is go over to blurbs click on blurbs one and choose blurbs and we're gonna add a new blurb which is gonna be the Google Local Dent Embed Badge. So now you want to paste over that that code that Google gave you to share this badge. So we're just going to take this whole thing here and paste that over to the content. Choose. Uh, next, you want to go over to. I'm going to do this all at once. I'm not going to drip this out. You know, you could uh, select if you want to drip it out between, you know, however many days you want. I'm just going to skip that. And I'm going to click on accounts and select what accounts I want to post this to. So I'm going to just uh, use some of these pre-existing accounts I have for... All 
Or I'll pick two more. Alright, let's just pick these uh, automotive. These are related. Okay, so you're going to click choose. And we have 189 accounts selected for this campaign. The next thing you want to do is go over to articles and content. And for this example, I'm just going to select auto generated content because we're not linking out to no money site here. You know, we're, uh, this is a few tiers back, you know, we're linking directly to a Google 301 and we're linking to we're, we're embedding the bat. So it doesn't really make a big difference. So we'll just do dent repair and select cars. You could leave this the way it is. And then you're going to click on save report. All right, so the project is now created and we're going to monitor the progress in the view projects tab. So I'll show you guys exactly what this looks like after a few of these posts are live. So give me a few minutes and I'll return back to this video. Okay guys, I'm back and this is the first post that went live. So you can see here we have our link which points over to the google.com 301. So I'm just going to open this in a new tab. You see it redirects over to the Google local page. So it's just a way to send some link juice sit in a safe manner over to your Google Plus local page instead of hitting it direct. And then you see the badge here, which is embedded. So the key here is you want to get this embedded in as many uh, niche related properties as possible because embed count does matter, you know, especially if you're adding relevance to the whole campaign. So this is just a quick tip I wanted to show you guys, you know, if you're doing local SEO or uh, lead generation and you have a map listing. Uh, this is a practice that I highly recommend. You know, you generate your badges and start sharing it across other profiles. And, you know, if you want to take it a step further, uh, share this badge on Google-owned profiles like uh, Blogger. You could also do uh, Sites.Google, I believe. But, yeah, guys, uh, take this strategy and run with it and report back any results you get from it. And let's keep this going. Thank you.